to Havana, Cuba, where dozens of people took to the streets to participate in a pride march that was not sanctioned by the government. The government actually canceled the event. That's right, and today's march ended with several people arrested. Hatsomela is the only South Florida reporter in Havana with this exclusive story. Call it unprecedented, likely the first of its kind. Gay Cuban activists without fear arrive at Havana's Parque Central. What started with a few turned to dozens. Siempre pacificamente. Siempre pacificamente. Always peaceful, they boasted, as they got ready to march from a park surrounded by Cuban police, some dressed in plain clothing. We want to show the world the Cuban gay community is not just senesex. This activist talking about the National Center for Sex Education, which earlier this week announced it was canceling the official parade, sparking this independent one. <laughs> they left the main square and headed down famous Prado Avenue, not the huge crowd they wanted. As reports swirled that through state security harassment and threats, some activists were kept from attending. This is video from last year's parade. The government says the official parade was canceled because it would be used by foreign forces to drive their own agenda. This alternate event, they said, was planned by groups back in Miami. Marchers here tell me if it doesn't happen again next year by way of the government, they're going to do one of these again. But given the conflict that was about to take place, it might be impossible. The crowd wanted to go beyond Prado and into Malecón. But they were warned not to because of traffic on the busy road. And minutes later, that's when the arrest went down. Four or five people ended up in police cars, many forced by undercover security agents, which were present throughout the march. The world is watching, he said, as I captured on my own cell phone another arrest where this man kept calling his captors abusers. Police reminding the crowd this was not an authorized march. Those arrested are known activists and independent journalists. I'm Hatsovella, Local 10 News, Havana.